Lydia Ko has 20 LPGA titles. Her next one will put her in the Hall of Fame. Could it be today, her third at eight? Seeing some sweaters today, Morgan. Karen mentioned the wind now out of the north. And uh, you'd have thought that was just going to roll straight over into today. That's her fourth shot at the par five. How far back will it come back? Oh, what a beauty. Wow. What a shot. That could save. And right now, the wind feels like it's pushing. This going to push this ball to the right. She played it as such. And that'll be a putt to take the lead. Alone presented by Progressive Insurance for Mao Saigo here at the 15th rookie from Japan had a very good season on the Japanese tour last year with five wins and this one looks pretty good at the 15th is it going to hang there up ahead Lydia Ko this for birdie yeah. to get within two. Lydia Ko within one point of the LPGA Hall of Fame. And here she is in contention again. Palm tree is going to cause her no issues. 124 to the hole. This is going to be a wedge. Good angle to, to that right flag. Uh, both Megan and Nelly have played this back nine very well so far this week. A championing earlier is that should the unthinkable happen and Lydia Ko not win another point one of the greatest players of the modern era wouldn't be in the Hall of Fame and Laura Davies how can you have an LPGA Hall of Fame without Laura Davies well uh, my point is she wouldn't have earned enough points so she wouldn't be in that's what I'm saying right just a moment ago this is Lindy Duncan for a birdie That is just incredible across the green. Maybe the longest part of the week hold. How about the stance here for Megan Kang at 12? Well, the ball's a little bit above her feet. She did take drive off the tee, hit it over the bunker, only had 68 yards left. Oh, look out. Well, we've seen a hole out from a bunker this week already. She did that on the 17th yesterday. This one's downwind, going to be tough to stop it. Good call. It's just really heavy sand here in this these bunkers, so it's tough to get enough spin. Just way choked up on this, trying to control something, hold it up against the right to left wind. Oh, kind of did hang out there, and she was fortunate that didn't catch the bunker the wind even though it feels like it's crossing from the right it, it kind of almost works back into as well so it's it depends on the the wind direction oh, that was class. a player that uh, is familiar with windy conditions the scott jimma dryborough at the 16th What a frame that one. Megan's got 159. Oh. A really smart play there. I just got to aim center of the green, let the wind drift this a little bit to the left. Solid shots are much less affected by the wind. So solid contact, very important here. And the club just got stuck in that upslope. I look like she took it back very much inside. Let's see what Lydia can do. Second shot to the par five. Oh, working it in left to right, trying to trundle one in there. And this is going to work out very well indeed. Could it be? What a time to hit a shot like that. 
That's incredible. That's a Hall of Fame shot there from Lydia Ko. Got plenty of green to get this one to land on the front and get it to release back to the hole. And this is a fading. Looks pretty good. And hang on, not over yet. Oh, what a shot, what a time. Hold the ceremony. We're not done yet. Nellie Corda for the second straight day, Eagle 17, and she is still in it. I'm trying to keep it down a little bit as well, Karen. Yeah, you, you've got to really buy into it. And this was not a low bullet. This has got some air to underneath it. Oh, Nelly. That's for the win. Incredible. We're not done yet. I mean, the greatest dig deep, even when it looks like everything is going the other direction. This one's gone to 11. Lydia and Nelly are going to play off at Bradenton Country Club. It's going a little bit of a draw. It'll be fine. You have to think that her emotions have been on a bit of a roller coaster since she completed her rounds. It's also going to be very nice. Closer to the hole. Fly. Pretty flat. She has the opportunity to put a lot of pressure on Nelly. Oh, this is left. Oh. Is that in the hospitality area? Or is it up against the wall? One more look. There it is. With the champagne on the team, a little downslope here. This is just a small controlled nine iron. Oh, that is the shot of a champion. here Karen a little bit this one's just down the down the right half I kind of hung up in the wind just a little bit so she also a little bit down the right half got another in a gust similar of wind. location to, uh, to where she was in regulation choking way up on this one Karen probably gonna flight it down like she loves to do this one's going more middle of the green. Proper tier though, huh? Short she's got in here, and the longest club that she's had to use. She's taken another aggressive line at it, very similar line to the first two shots. Oh, that needs to settle. Everything slopes away over the screen. Just when it's just on top of the ball. Get in the hole.
door is open. It's a quarter kick again at the finish. And it's enough for Nelly to win for the ninth time and deny Lydia Ko a spot so far in the Hall of Fame. Fuck yeah. You deserve that. Look at all that emotion on her face. I mean, what a roller coaster this entire weekend has been for Nelly. And to win at home on a day when it truly looked giving it away in the middle of this back nine. Eagle, birdie to get into the playoff and then the par on the second extra hole for win number nine. Flag drop for Jason McDeeter, caddy. And Lydia will have to wait a little bit longer. 네, LPGA 코리아 유튜브 채널이 오픈을 했는데요. 어, 많은 분들의 관심과 응원 부탁드리고요. 어, 구독과 좋아요 네, 꼭 눌러주세요.